Well, we, so the cancers we work with are primarily ovarian cancer, pancreatic cancer, prostate cancer, and lung cancer. So the wiring or the network in cancer cells is quite different than the network that was present in the precursor cells. And so when you go to treat that cancer, you, you can't go in and assume that the interactions that you know in the normal cells is the way you should uh, interact with the, with the drugs to treat it you have to realize that the wiring is completely different. We're trying to tie in our therapeutic approaches to our concept that the cancer cells are an interacting network and not to think about treating cancer with a single drug but uh, in ways that would systematically treat the disease. That's got us interested in these molecules called microRNAs. These are small regulatory RNAs that function normally in our cells, but how they function is to control expression of hundreds of genes that are of related functions. And so we're exploring the use of microRNAs therapeutically because when they're added into a cancer cells, they don't attack a single gene, they attack hundreds of genes. And we're trying to look for microRNAs that may um, interfere with this new network that has arisen in cancer cells. We're taking a so-called systems approach, this looking uh, holistically at the cell, and that requires computational uh, analyses that can't be done unless you have College of Computer Science nearby to do it. So uh, I think a lot of what we're doing that makes us unique is really just these interactions and the integration of the and leveraging of the strengths that are here at Georgia Tech focused onto the problem of cancer.